And this is regarding the opioid crisis. And what I found out, recorded, is recorded. There's doctors with probate courts and with other natures of courts tied to them, using that to cover up lie progressions tied to database crimes, evidence is racked, it's formal, and with the areas, and overtly getting land. In other words, the people, the doctors, uh, with patients that have problems with drugs, they're also involved with the gangs and with investigations with the military with the drugs. And with the schools, the, these are the drug dealers of the schools tied to the cops, recorded arresting kids for, for drugs, but they're the ones facilitating it. And they're also been framing kids to, and to, to maintain this, to maintain life progression covers that they need constantly. Because <clears throat> they're thwarting federal investigations with and as other federal agents and other states, areas are made criminal intonation persuaded, cultivated from a propagated base for this. America lost in the American Revolution because our founders were still extorted. They still want that told, but our but, but the you can't tell that in the in the books written by our our colonizers at the same time, which was intonation. Intonation sciences were entrenched here and not allowed to talk about it because they knew they were going to force England as the face of it to only let fact treatment natures uh, divided and conquered. That's that's what happens when you don't understand your history. We have, we have base, simple logic, base animal logic, formal with, with convictions about what's, what to do with the, uh, the money the state owes. The governor of Connecticut knows that he's involved, he's recorded involved with school crimes against kids, with doctors, with courts. Doctors are the opioid problem. And they want to put more money into that because that's what they're being used to hide evidences, rackets tied to the uh, alternatives to, to being, be, being imprisoned with the courts. In other words, also with them involved with rackets, not letting the right to be uh, the, the presumed innocence, which was for, so, so they don't evidence fabricate, attach people to fake conversations, which they did after our founding and st still doing because of this. They're pretending people, see, they're, they're pretending all. <clears throat> Sick doctors with drugs and kids are pretending that other people have problems like they have. You know what I mean? They have no credibility with the doctors, men and women. So there's sick women that I never had a conversation with, pretending to have conversation, have because because they got they've been using this place to cover up when they get trapped with area crimes. So I caught them with a detective Dylan, and and with uh undercovers and regular people with the with with the uh and patients with the Harford Hospital involved with sex crimes with kids, and evidence is wrecked and drugs with them. And they're involved in my name. They've been slandered because they, they have these, they have all these strangers make confessions to me through time. Every time I go to report it, they won't let me do it because they have those strangers make those confessions progressively per a method that has that, has formal people, because judges are tied to this too, confessed and recorded, tied criminal. They have upskirt natures with the kids. You know what I mean? With the doctors with the opioid problems with the, with, with, with the hospitals. They've been using that background information, database rackets, evidence rackets in the background. When people go into court, they don't let them have the, the right to uh, assume to presume innocence. And worse, they admit that they're, 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 they're th using the courts to threaten and attach people to torture. And they're, and they're going to, you know, you know they, they do, they'll do it more. If you try to talk about reality, recorded reality, there, there's evidence is rackets hurting our kids. So that, in other words, the upskirts nature is fur, further recorded, still tied to the schools and the governor, still recorded tied to judges at various natures of courts at once, and prison clicks tied to Sandy Hook with my area, and various recorded multiple mul uh, FBI confessions, and recorded crimes demonstrating their involvements with the child crimes in my area through the time, and with John Lyano, and with his ties to New Britain's superior court corruption, uh, 
uh, newspaper corruption, media corruption. They won't correct the stories because they have roles with the organized crime that's not letting, letting um, innocent people proven to prove that in courts. They're not letting uh, guilty judges and, and, and police using courts to cover their roles with upskirt skirt natures and database crimes and evidence rackets covers with schools. You know, with database, with EMS, fire, because they have database. Town offices, they have some, some guy with the town offices recorded tied to crimes with the sex criminal doctors. But you see, they won't get, they, they're hiding names, but those are the people they give the names to of the other people because then they make them pretend they were in a conversation with them. See, I kept my mouth shut through time because I've been watching this since I was a kid with progressive live progressions. Because the same grammar school with the upskirt natures further recorded and proven. They still they were they, they were involved with uh, rackets with, with kids when I when I was a kid that, that I don't even barely know. But now those those men and women are, are recorded involved in abuses of other kids with that school. And with other schools, they're connected. Like there's a grammar school next to Lena's Pizza also confessed, connected. And, 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 and they make confessions of that tied to a number of uh, federal crimes and, and untimely deaths tied to court police associated with that place and with the areas. And with uh, Eric, Eric, Eric um, Burgess associated with him, he made confessions about this. He was supposed to be my source for CCSU was using him for evidence brackets. He was going to do it, but then a, a court police extorted him, his fact treatment somehow. And then the story, so now everyone's hiding and lying I, and, and pretending they don't realize. Also, he, he made, I, I don't know the, his, his girlfriend's name, but she was recorded in the court making confessions about this. And before this, I would, and I tried to report it before that. The court in Hartford. I don't know her. And she said that um, it was her, and it was a. a, a <clears throat> there's a uh, officer Hunter, also, evidence racket role, uh, tied to the uh, CCSU confessions, and he has sex crime roles with the with abusing, with the men and women, interbranch abusing the girls on and off campus. You know, getting people arrested on and off campus, regular students, with evidence rackets. They're, they're not even be able to see what they're being charged for and, and all, the, all the BS in the background. They're using the, uh, they're using the, all, all our functions of the state. That's where all the money's going. Take it from the opioid doctors. That's the, they're, they're the ones facilitating the street drug crimes. You know, they, they owe a lot of money. I mean, they, they, they owe more than money. It's, it's priceless what they've been wasting. This is why, this is no excuse for, 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 for uh, them not to own this place by now. Because, because their fact treatment natures are flawed and they're not letting the, 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 the them hiding lies, delusions, and premises demonstrate internation, criminal internation persuasions.